So today we're gonna go ahead and stress test the beautiful Model Y. Not a typical stress test though, we wanna stress back here. So I believe the manual states back here can hold like 300 pounds, mainly due to these pieces right here, which are actually foam. These are actually foam, kind of crazy to think. We have these Testmanian floor mats in here. They've been working out great. So it'll be a stress test for them too, but I have a bunch of tile I need to go pick up because we're remodeling a bathroom and we're retiling the shower as well as the floor. So I kind of want to see, can we fit it all back here? I think we might be picking up like 600 pounds. So we're probably definitely gonna over like stress this, probably by twofold, maybe more. Not exactly sure which tile we're gonna go with yet, so it's hard to calculate right now. But I do wanna see, are we going to overload it? Can the springs handle it? Is the back just gonna collapse? I don't know. It's all good things to find out. So we're gonna run to the store real quick, go ahead and pick out all our tile, wish us luck, and we will see you when we return. As long as the car didn't break down. Okay, so Model Y, I just got home with a bunch of tile and mortar, doing some house projects, wanted to test it out. Um, that's a lot of weight. Uh, <laughs> that's like 970 pounds worth of mortar, tile, all kinds of stuff. And as you can see, we're running real low. And I mean real low. By the way, for reference, this is the front. This is what the back normally looks like. But this is a good test because we drove home maybe like 30 or so miles. So let's see how it all looks. Also a good test of the Tasmanian all weather floor mats here from Model Y. Link them below. And save yourself 10% off if you decide to order any. But let's check it out. Three bags of mortar, 50 pounds a piece. Eight boxes of floor tile, 50.6 pounds a piece. And last seven boxes of floor tile at 59.52 pounds a piece. And whatever this thing weighs and some nails and stuff. So all in if my math serves me right, it's 971.44 pounds in the back. Wow. And here you can see that is a little bit more like it should be. We were riding really low before, didn't even clean anything up. That's what the floor mat looks like and everything. All these held up just fine. So let's wipe this down, see how it looks. Okay, so here it is, all wiped down. Just real quick, not much at all. And the nice thing is even with like a thousand pounds on it, everything still held its shape, all these channels everything I'm pushing down you can kind of see they compress a little bit but with the weight off of them everything is back to normal how awesome is that really saved all the carpet and everything from being torn up from all that tile and now it looks great so overall stress test on the model y it did great almost a thousand pounds back here not quite sure what it's rated for but i don't think it's quite a thousand but it's definitely doable. Just make sure you're not bottoming out on this spring, which we weren't 
just something you should keep an eye on. But yeah, just wanna do a quick video showing you that real quick. As always though, if you are interested in accessorizing your Tesla Model S, X, 3, and now Y, definitely check out our channel sponsor, Abstract Ocean. All listed down below using code Tesla Inventory will get you 15% off of your first purchase. As always though, thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it. Go and click here to subscribe here for some other ones, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.